Good morning, Stephanie Cameraman, the Stock Whisper here with today's Daily Dark Pool Whispers for June 3rd, 2020. All right, everybody's watching this spy. Guess what? We hit a big level, 310. Yeah, that would be the first test. Definitely had some pretty decent volume coming in there. So watch that second test. Uh, we do have R2. Let me show you that. R2 right here, persons pivots, yeah, at 310.13 right here. Yeah, so this is really the big trade. Yeah, we need to really break above this wall. But I was bullish above 309.75. Yeah, key level, but this is really the big trade and this is the big, bigger kahuna trade up. And we're gonna be bearish below 307, below the pivot. Yeah, this is like a no a no trade zone for me. For the spy. So let's watch that. See if we can do it. Let's go to the E-minis. E-minis, we're going to be bullish above 3100 and bearish below 3085. 3100 is yeah, pretty key level. We've um yeah, moved up quite a bit today. Let's go to the QQQs. Bullish above 237. Bear below 235.80. We got the NASDAQ futures. Uh, bullish above 97.05. Bear below 96.50. And let's head on to the oil futures. Oops, hold on a minute. Q. Massive volume came in right here at six o'clock in the morning. Really, really big. So um, yeah, we wanna be bullish above that. That's why I picked the level 3780. Yeah, I, I need to climb above all that volume. Uh, bearish below 3660, and we've already gone down and hit quite a few targets on this. So let's go to the gold futures. Go ahead and click on this. Gold futures bullish above a lot of my traders are short gold overnight in boot camp. That trade is working out pretty nicely, you guys. Um, so you wanna watch these gold futures. Bullish above 1732.50 and bear below 17.15. Yeah, we'll see if we go below that. Let's go to the individual stocks. I got a couple good ones for you guys. So MU. MU, that 48 level is really key. Yep, we kind of got stuck on this 90 simple moving average. How many of you do not have this on your charts yet? 90 SMA, it's so good. Put it on there, it's free. Doesn't cost you anything, it's really good. We got stuck on there. I'm gonna be bullish above 48.20 for the gap and go higher trade to this 200 simple moving average. All right, it was a really good swing trade overnight. I know, who has it in the boot camp? Somebody took MU long overnight, called it out this morning. Yeah, nice job on that, yep. I would definitely take some profit here. I would take half off the table. And my next um, target would be the 200 simple moving average. Let's go, to, and I'll be bearish for retracement trade, 47.25. Let's go to ZM. Zoom had earnings. We're gonna be bullish above 215.50, bear below 205 for retracement trade for Zoom. Neo, Neo, Neo. We have been watching this one all morning long. The price action has been crazy, ridiculously good. We spotted a big seller at 518, and I did post that for you guys right here, right? Massive seller at 518. Yeah, I'm actually gonna show you a picture of that. See this guy right here? See him in gray, 518, 250,000 right there. 400, he moved by the way. Yep, he moved and I'm gonna just zoom in on this picture for you guys. He moved to 520, he spoofed. 
but he was selling and refreshing at 516. So this is going to be key to watch uh, for you guys. Yep, I'm only going to be bullish above 520. The first 10 minutes, they might spike it up. Yeah, I don't trade and enter the first 10 minutes. I've seen that a lot, and then they crash it down. After the first 10, 15 minutes, if NEO is above 520, bullish. If it's not, bearish. No thinking. We'll be watching that one for sure. Um, bearish below 495. Let's go to Oxy. Oxy, bullish above 1520. And bear below 1445. Carnival. Bullish only above 17.25, bearish below 17.50. We just went below the bear level, you guys. Yeah, not looking pretty if we uh, stay below there. Tiffany, nobody's buying diamonds right now in quarantine. Uh, bullish above 119 for a retrace. Oops, retrace up to the four EMA possibly, or there's a nice trade from there to there. So bearish below 117. And let's go to Wells Fargo. Wells Fargo, bullish above 28 was our whisper yesterday, still bullish above that. Right now we're hitting resistance on Wells Fargo. Let me show you, it's a Camarilla. Yep, watch this level moving. I know a lot of us are still swinging this one. Um, yep, we're hitting this uh, blue aqua uh, blue line right here. That's Camarilla resistance. Yep. We have 2835 here. If we can break above that, the sky is clear. So I'm really looking for that big pocket, but we might, yeah, might not be able to, to go above that just yet. This is why you want to scale out at these levels. All right, let's go to American Airlines. Bullish above 1160 and bear below 11.25. There you have it, you guys. Those are your whispers for June 3rd. Until next time, happy trading. No thinking, that's my secret. Can you keep it? My secret. My secret.